Welcome on back, Rebel Herd, to another episode of Lone Star Wrangler Football. We're 4-3 and three on the year, and this week we go up against Conference USA opponent Southern Miss. They've had the better of us the last couple years. It's time to get some revenge. But first, we got to check in with some recruiting. we got some recruits visiting this week. Let's see what they want from us. We have a kicking recruit coming this week. The idea was to redshirt him while Henry plays out his senior year next year, or he might move him to punter to take over for Matt O'Rourke for next year. But he's coming to visit this week, and he wants us to kick a 40-yard field goal. Do we need Henry? Henry to boot a 40-yard field goal. That might be tough. Chris Franklin is an athlete, 70 overall. Looks like he slots in at a linebacker. He wants two sacks from a linebacker. Chris Bracken, a 63 overall halfback. He wants us to rush for 100 yards with a halfback. Chris Phillips, a 63 overall middle linebacker. He also wants us to have two sacks with a linebacker. D. Hunter, a 63 overall defensive end. He wants us to have three sacks with defensive linemen and two tackles for loss. Justin Simpson, a 61 overall wide receiver. He wants us to pass for over 250 yards. Yards. Richard Steele, 61 overall middle linebacker. He wants us to get two sacks with linebackers. Finally, Chris Sims, a 60 overall free safety. He wants us to have two interceptions with DBs or four swatted passes with DBs. Kirk Herbstreet's actually picking us to win this game. Southern Miss is 2-4 and four on the season, 1-1 one one in Conference USA play. Third, 83 overall, 86 offense, 80 defense. Let's see if we can take down the Southern Miss Golden Eagles at home. Let's go. And welcome to beautiful Wrangler Stadium in the heart of Houston, Texas. It's a beautiful night for football, and there's lots of Wrangler fans in the stands. We'll start the game kicking off. Henry to boot it deep. Let's get a win against the Southern Miss Eagles. Let's go. Well, flag on the opening kickoff. It's a clipping call. This will knock them back away. So we'll start this drive from the 13-yard line. Golden Eagles start off with a quick pass on the wide receiver screen. Gain of five yards, second and five. Running back runs it to the left for six yards, moves the sticks, first down. Owen Steele takes him down after a five-yard gain, second down and five. Quarterback finds a wide receiver over the middle of the field, gets three yards, sets up third down and two. Quarterback throws it quick with a blitz just about to hit him. Wide receiver drops it, it's fourth and two, here comes a punt team. We'll start this drive from our 40-yard line. Powell's way off, second and ten. No gain on the play. Third down and 10. The blitzing linebacker gets in free and takes down Powell before he can throw the ball away. But the punt, fourth and 17. Decent return, they'll start in our territory, short field. Quarterback finds an open wide receiver, he gains 20 yards on the corner route, first down. McGraw brings him down after a two-yard gain on the run. Second down and eight. Quarterback throws it away. Blitz getting in his face. Third down and eight. Again, five yards on third down and eight. Brings up fourth down and three. Here comes the kicker to kick a field goal. And the kick's right down the middle. Southern Miss goes up three-nothing here in the first quarter. Incomplete, second and ten. Slants incomplete, third down and ten. Powell throws a duck to nobody. Linebacker picks it off. It's a turnover and the Southern Miss Golden Eagles take over at the 39 yard line. Quarterback gets the wide receiver over the middle of the field. Eight yard gain, second and two. Tight end makes the catch, gets eight yards, first down. And the wide receiver makes his way to the end zone. He gets upended by Reynolds before he makes it in, but it's a touchdown. And the Southern Miss Golden Eagles go up 10 to nothing. With a head full of steam, Steamboat Sammy forward. He gets 14 yards and a first down. Let's go. Simpson takes a handoff, gets up the field for seven yards. Second down and three. Simpson has nowhere to go. Stopped in the backfield. Loss of three. Third down and six. Powell throws it way too quick after the snap, and nobody's even looking yet. It's incomplete. Fourth and six. We'll start this drive from the 32-yard line. The quarterback somehow gets the pass away before the sack can get to him. It's incomplete. Second and ten. Quarterback fits out through a tight window. It's third down and three. Which Powell was that accurate right now? Quarterback finds a wide receiver open, gets the first down inside Wrangler territory. 12 gauge takes him down after a two yard gain, second down and eight. Wide receiver catches the out route, cuts it up real quick for a big gain, first down. 
Another wide receiver screen gets him eight yards, second down and two. And that's the end of the first quarter. Southern Miss has a 10-0 lead over the Lone Star Wranglers. Offense can't get anything going right now. I don't even think we've completed a pass. Buck Rhinestone takes down the quarterback for a loss of four on the play. A dirt nap for the Grave Digger sets up third down and six. And Wesson gets the interception. A great play by the cornerback. And it's Wrangler ball at the 21-yard line. Nice snag there on the sideline. Steambo Sammy Fogarty takes the handoff. Gets four yards on the carry. Second down and six. Powell keeps it on the read option, gets 10 yards and a first down. And somehow the linebacker is able to pick it up just before it hits the ground off the double clutch interception, and he takes it all the way to the house. Southern Miss goes up 17 to nothing. Still looking to see if Powell can complete a pass. He's thrown two passes caught by the other team, none to our team. We'll start this draft from the 25. Powell throws it up for Gamma Lee, but Gamma Lee can't get a track on it, it's incomplete. Simpson takes the pitch on the triple option, gets three yards, third down and seven. The blitz disrupts the pass, it's fourth and seven, we have to punt. We'll start this drive at the 40 yard line, defense needs to get a stop here. Wide receiver makes the toe tap and catch on the comeback, gain a nine, second and one. The 12 gauge takes him down for no gain on the play, it's third down and one. They hit the tight end on the out route and gain two yards, first down. Quarterback hits the pass, gaining nine second and inches. This guy's 14 for 18. I don't think we've completed a pass yet. Ooh, a big penalty there. Second and inches turns into second and six. A long second down and five. They gain three yards on the run up the middle. Third down and two. Johnny Reynolds takes him down after a one yard gain. Stops him before he can get the first down. It's fourth and one. They go for it on fourth and one, try to run the option, and Pierre's there to take down the quarterback as another man takes down the running back. And it's a turnover on downs. Defense stands tall. Powell throws that just a little too far. He's 0 for 9 to start the day, second and 10. This is straight up stupid. Finally on the 10th pass attempt, Powell hits a target. He finds Robbie Lawless for a big gain and a first down. Holy crap. Powell keeps it on the triple option, can't get anywhere, no gain. Simpson takes the give, sets up third down and seven after a three yard gain. And Powell just needed to throw that on the line and he throws it way too far, it's knocked away by the safety. We're gonna go for it, it's fourth and seven. Nobody open anywhere, Powell just throws it away. Turnover on downs. McGraw brings the law, takes down the quarterback on the read option for a loss of one. Second and 11. Southern Miss called a timeout. Just over two minutes to go before halftime. They are on the draw on second and 11, get 10 yards, brings a third down and one. Get the first down, first and 10 at the 48. Get one yard, second and nine. Just over a minute on the clock. Wide receiver drops the pass, sets up third down and nine. Pierre and Brown run into each other. They were covering the running back perfectly until they ran into each other, and they get a big gain on the screenplay. It's first and 10 at the 16. Quarterback hits the wide receiver for a five yard gain on the stop route, second and five. Quarterback gets it away just before Brown can hit him, finds a wide receiver on the comeback route. It's caught, first and goal at the three. And White gets the sack on the quarterback with the DB blitz. Pierre got there first, but missed the tackle. Quarterback throws it out of the back of the end zone. Third and goal, they're gonna try a field goal here. And the kick's right down the middle. It's Southern Miss 20, Lone Star nothing. Going into halftime, Lone Star offense can't get anything going. The defense has been on the field most of the game. We need to have a great second half if we're gonna to try to win this game. Let's go. We'll start our first drive of the second half at the 25 yard line. Powell keeps it on the read option, powers forward for four yards, second and six. And a clip is called on our left tackle. That brings it back, second and nine. Fogarty takes the handoff on the read option, gets up the field for one yard, third down and eight. Powell finally completes another pass. He's two for 14 today, but that's a big gainer to Gamma Lee. First down into Southern Miss territory, let's go. 
Maybe his arms finally warmed up now that it's the second half, right? Did he actually like throw passes at halftime to warm up? Sure shit wasn't warmed up in the first half. Powell keeps it on the read option, powers forward for four yards, second down and six. Powell throws that too tight of the line. Luckily, he doesn't pick it off, third down and six. Knocks it away incomplete, it's fourth down and six. On fourth and six, Corey Moss catches the slant route for eight yards. It's a first down. Steamboat Sammy Fogarty takes the read option give, cuts it up the middle, gets a block, and with a handful of steam, he's in the end zone. Lone Star's finally on the board. Here in the third quarter, it's Southern Miss 20, Lone Star 7. Let's start this draft from the 22-yard line. McGraw takes down the tight end after a one-yard gain on the out route, second down and nine. Running back breaks off some tackles, gets up the field for a first down run. Quarterback finds a wide receiver over the middle of the field, hits him for a four yard gain. Quarterback gets it away quick to the out route with the blitz coming, it's third down and three. Gunner Cannon takes the running back for a ride, a loss of four on the play, and it's fourth down and seven, defense gets off the field. We'll start this drive from the 39. Simpson takes the pitch and runs it all the way inside the five-yard line, and then he fumbles. Southern Miss scoops it up. They trip and fall down at the eight-yard line. They'll start this drive at the eight. Rusty Westwood thinks Clyde Simpson might have been down. We're going to challenge him. He's down. He is down. And we made the right call. They overturned the fumble. It's first and goal from the four-yard line. Powell keeps it on the read option. Gets two yards, second and goal from the two yard line. Clyde Simpson takes the toss and he runs into the end zone for his own touchdown. And Lone Star cuts the lead to six. It's the Wranglers 14, the Golden Eagles 20. we will start this draft from the 29 yard line. They run the draw, get eight yards, second down and two. They run it up the middle for a five yard gain and move the sticks. Backyard running back gets four yards on the gain. Second down and six. Bill Brown brings him down after a one yard gain. Third down and five. The backup running back busts off. I think half our defense just tried to tackle him and he broke off every one of them. Ranger McGraw finally pushes him out of bounds. First down inside Wrangler territory. Another draw play gets him six yards, second down and four. Quarterback finds a tight end on the corner route. Gets past Morgan, there's nobody left, and it's a touchdown. Southern Miss goes up 27 to 14. We'll start this drive at the 19-yard line. See if the offense can move the ball again. Powell forces Ganley to break off the corner out perfectly. He makes the catch and gets up the field for a big gain. First down for the Wranglers. Steamboat Sammy takes the pitch, breaks off a tackle and gets five yards on the gain. Second down and five. Matt Henry gets six yards on the fullback triple option pitch. And that's the end of the third quarter. It's Southern Miss 27, Lone Star 14. Put up those fours, Wrangler fans. Let's get this comeback win right here. Simpson takes a handoff on the read option, gets five yards, second down and five. Another read option give to Clyde Sisson. Gets him five yards and moves the sticks. Powell keeps it on that read option. Gets four yards, second down and six. Steamboat Sammy Fogarty refuses to go down off the initial tackle. He was sitting on top of the defender trying to get up. He had a 16 and a first down on the play. Powell hits another pass to Fogarty. Four yard gain, second down and six. Robbie Lawless drops the touchdown. Would have been six for sure. And it's third down and six. Cole Winchester takes the post route and he powers his way into the end zone. It's Southern Miss 27, Wranglers 21. We'll start this drive at the 27 yard line. Defense needs to get a stop here. Ranger McGrath takes him down after a gain of one on the play. Passes incomplete, sets up third down and nine. Another draw up the middle, four yard gain, McGraw takes him down. Second and six. Passes offline, incomplete, it's third down and six. 
Wide receiver makes the catch, but he can't cut it up the field. Fourth down and four. They're going to have to punt. Nick Shoots gets a nice return there. 20 yards. We'll start this drive at the 35-yard line. Powell keeps it on the read option, gets five yards, second down and five. Powell keeps it on the read option again, 13 yards and a first down. Powell hits Corey Moss on the stop route, 10 yard gain and a first down. Gets knocked away by the DB, second down and 10. Powell keeps it on the read option, gets six yards, third down and four. Clyde Simpson keeps his feet, gets five yards, and moves the sticks. First down and 10. Powell hits big play at Bobby Haynes for a nine yard gain. Second down and one. Powell keeps it on the read option, gets nine yards, sets up first down and goal from the nine yard line. Cameron Lee can't hold on to the slant pass. Incomplete. Second and goal from the nine yard line. Powell hits Fogarty for a six yard gain, sets up third and goal inside the five. Rusty calls a timeout. Two minutes on the clock, it's fourth and goal at the one. Here comes the offense on the field. One play to tie the game, extra point to win it. Powell runs a sneak to perfection, finds the end zone. Lone Star goes up 28 to 27. The crowd's going crazy here in Wrangler Stadium. There's gonna be a party in downtown Houston tonight. Just need a defensive stop. Knock the pass out as he catches it. Second down and 10. And it's a big gain. 28 yards moves the ball into Wrangler territory first down. They run the draw, get four yards, second down and six. Minute and a half to go on the clock. They get the first down inside the 40 yard line. And it's first down. Defense can't get anything going right here. Oh, Wyatt knocks the pass down, sets up second and 10. Should have been an interception. Owen Steele knocks the pass away, brings up third down and 10. And Arthur Morgan makes the tackle, stops him from getting the first down. That's gonna bring out the kicker for a field goal. 44 seconds on the clock. And the kick is good. Southern Miss goes back in the lead. It's Southern Miss 30, Lone Star 28 with 41 seconds on the clock. We'll start this drive at the 25, 41 seconds to get into field goal range. Powell gets the pass away before the sack can get to him. Second down and 10. Dumping off the Moss for a five yard gain. Third down and five. Clock's ticking. Corey Moss catches it, breaks off two tackles and gets out of bounds. Pass midfield, 14 seconds on the clock after the 23 yard gain. DB knocks it away, incomplete. Eight seconds on the clock. We gotta get into field goal range. And it's gonna come down to the leg of Henry. A 46 yard field goal to win it. is the kick off the crossbar it's no good 45 yards is henry's range that was a 46 yarder and we found out in the worst of ways and southern miss gets the win by two points here at home against the wranglers it's 30 to 28 the hell of a ball game if we could have scored points in the first half it would have been our game offense couldn't get it going until the second half it's heartbreak here in houston and here's the tail of the tape. Southern Miss wins 30 to 28. We had 16 first down, 385 yards of total offense. We ran it 29 times for 190 yards on the ground with three touchdowns. We were 13 for 32 with one touchdown and 195 yards through the air. We're four for 11 on third downs, three for four on fourth downs, and three for three inside the red zone. We had two turnovers on the day. We threw two interceptions, but our defense also had a turnover of their own. Foul start of the day, 0 for 9, end of the day, 13 for 30 with 195 yards, one touchdown, and two interceptions. Leading the rushing attack, Clyde Simpson had 87 yards and a touchdown. Hit along a 
58 on that big triple option play. Powell had 51 yards of his own and a touchdown there at the end with the QB snake. Ogerty had 46 yards of his own plus a nice 22 yard touchdown. Through the air, Gamma Lee led in yards with two catches for 62 yards. Corey Moss had four catches for 46 yards. Robbie Lawless had two catches for 38 yards. And Colt Winchester caught our lone touchdown through the air, a 14 yard catch. We had two pancakes on the day. Peter Beater had one, and Billy Bob Jenkins had one. On the defensive side of the ball, Granger McGraw tried to do it all. He brought the law 12 times, one tackle for loss. Gunner Cannon had a decent day, seven tackles of his own. And Dexter McClintock rounded out the top three in tackles with six tackles of his own. We had one sack on the day when we needed to get a bunch to make our recruits happy. We had one interception on the day. Andrew Weston caught it. Even with the loss, we still got some commits. Chris Banks, 77 overall kicker, commits to the team. Lawrence Hamilton, 73 overall left hand, commits to the team. Chris Franklin, 70 overall right outside linebacker, commits to the team. And also D. Hunter, 63 overall right hand, commits to the team. That does it for this episode of Lone Star Wrangler Football. May have lost this game, but we're not out yet. We're 4 and 4 on the year, and next time we take on the first place team in the Conference USA West, the UTEP Miners. We're on the road to El Paso, so don't miss it. Until then, folks, remember don't drink downstream from the herd.